Coyote scare in Orange County. Fish and game agents have killed four of the animals in Irvine Springbrook Park after a little boy was attacked there over the weekend. Yeah, KCAL 9 Orange County reporter Michelle Geely has more on other safety precautions being taken to make sure no one else gets hurt. I saw the coyote was just ready to attack the another baby from the behind. Residents in this Woodbridge neighborhood in Irvine are still shook up after a six year old was bit by a coyote in Springbrook Park and a smaller boy was nearly attacked while playing in the sand Sunday. It's the same spot where a man took this cell phone video in August. Now, fish and wildlife wardens reveal that four coyotes were trapped close by in the last 48 hours and killed because of the danger to the public. The trapping began Tuesday night and went into early this morning. Wildlife officials say the community garden below Winter Mist Park in the Woodbridge community is one of the spots where coyotes hang out and where the traps were set. Anytime there is an animal that attacks a child, our department makes an effort to take that animal out of the population if possible. The coyote dragged the boy at least three feet, witnesses say, clenching his teeth into his shirt sleeve, biting him. The animal was only afraid when someone threw sand to get it to leave. Officials tell us it's the third bite reported in the area in two months and that Irvine is a hot spot for coyotes. In the summer of 2015, six people, including small children, were attacked by coyotes. I've never had a problem with them personally. He's never had a problem with them. His sister's, his sister's terrified of them, though. The experts will try and match evidence from the boy's bite to the coyotes that were euthanized to try and determine if the offending animal has been caught. They acknowledge, though, it'll be difficult because the wound was cleaned. Rabies tests will also be done. Some residents wonder why they are seeing so many coyotes lately and whether they're being driven out of their homes by construction. The first responsibility for any government agency is the safety of the public. So regardless of your feelings on who was here first and whose right it is to be here, uh, the safety of our children will always be the most important thing. Even with the trapping, the warden says she'll never be able to say the area is 100% safe. Intervine, Michelle Geely, KCAL 9 News.